Well, hey, YouTube, PD Two Finger here, talking about stuff that confuses me that I can't remember. Specifically, LED polarity stuff, anodes, cathodes, flat spot, short lead, long lead. What gives? So, when I was a kid, typically you would measure out uh, wire. There would be this black wire, and it would have like speaker wire. You know, it would be black wire, and it would be a white stripe on one of the wires. And up until a certain point, you could always count on that wire with the stripe being the ground. So to me, stripe always designated ground. Up until a certain point more recently, um, me drink coke, me play joke. Uh, certain comp comp countries that make this stuff have switched it where the stripey wire is always hot. So the ultimate lesson in this is not me drink coke, me put pee pee and play joke. It's always use your multimeter. Don't use a limerick, a moon writing, or any other tool that you've developed. Of course, focusing on this, me making this video is going to help me to remember uh, specifically certain things that I'm always forgetting that I learned in basic electronics. Well, I, I was probably tripping in basic electronics. Who am I kidding? So I did not learn a single thing in basic electronics. I failed myself and now I'm having to go back and try to cement this stuff into my, uh, my brain where a little guy comes running out and says, nope, you burnt this whole wing of this of your brain out completely at that Pink Floyd concert. Remember that? So uh, one way for me to remember would be the A node. If I poke myself and I'm bleeding, that would be the A node. The A node would be the positive wire. These LEDs come served with a long wire and a short wire. And what gives is the long wire is the A node is the positive, is the red. The cathode, on the other hand, that is the, well, the cat. It's got it right in there. And when I think of cat, I think of a black cat. So that black tells me ground. There is a guy, a music guy, Frank Black and the Catholics. Frank Black, he always wears black, and that would denote ground. So cath, C-A-T-H, cathode, Catholic, Frank Black, it all kinds of ties together. Basically what you end up with is the cathode is the ground, is the minus, is the green, is the grizzle, is the flat spot, is the short leg. It's much like the electrolytic capacitor. We have a long leg, which is the hot leg. I can always remember that. Now I just need to remember hot leg is a node, and that the cathode is the short leg. It's usually clearly marked on an electric electrolytic, at least the minus symbol by the short leg. So the square hole on the PCB when you're going to install an LED on a circuit board, I'll have one round, one square. What gives with that? Well, usually the round hole will be the positive and the square hole will be the green or grizzle or ground or cathode. So the square hole, and it all kind of lines up. If you look at it, you have your long hole, uh, long, you have your long uh, A node wire, and then the shorter, uh, the shorter one has a cutout, and that cutout lines up with the word cathode, how there's that T up there. That's your minus symbol. That's also the cutout, and that as you drop that in, if you look at it from the right angle, you drop it in, that cutout lines up with the square hole, the square pad. Uh, so here we have a slightly different uh, idea of the square pad, the round versus the square. We have one that's just filled in with white. And again, what I got to tell you is use your meter. Plop your meter in that left, that white spot, put it on count, and then go over to a clearly marked 
ground or a ground that you know to be a ground and go ahead and see if you got cut. Beep, beep. If it beeps, well, there you go. There's your ground. Uh, clearly marked on the second one down, A note and cathode. The cathode has the flat spot. The flat spot is also that negative symbol, and that's where the, the light is pointing to. You see those, the light emitting from the diode, and it's pointing towards the cathode sign. So these are all clues that are going to help you to install this stuff properly. Uh, and, and if you can remember that the A node, you know, turning it sideways, it's it looks like an A. It's a triangle. It's kind of an A in, it, in and of itself. So that's the A node. Then you have the line for the cathode. Also, our our light em is emitting, pointing at the cathode, pointing at the ground. Uh, the line on the cathode side, also the uh, that being the shorter of the two legs, you could think of that line being the actual uh, missing, what's missing from that leg is what they used to denote that line. So there's another way of thinking it. But mainly if we come back to our stated fact, A node is positive and that the cathode is negative, that's certainly going to be helpful. Uh, remembering that the A node is the long leg, that the cathode is the short leg, that the cathode has the flat spot and the square. So however you uh, get that straight in your head, uh, or if this was more confusing, I can't apologize because quite honestly, I made this for me. And I realize doing stuff like this, it uh, people get furious, people shake their fists, they leave nasty comments, which is fine. Uh, I, I love it when people are talking about me. I'm just a huge attention whore. The only reason I made this channel was to set the world on fire with my guitar to become the next great YouTube celebrity. I'm, uh, that's all that I care about is views and trolling other people. That's why I uh, take hours out of my day to make basic electronic videos uh, explaining the difference between an A-node and a cathode to myself. All right, you guys, I hope this didn't make any itself sense at all to you. I hope it confused you more, and I wish you nothing but bad luck, and uh, hope that you rot, because that's the type of person I really am. I'm just a terrible, horrible, insecure person who is just extremely jealous of everyone else because they have all their fingers. My hand is still numb. I overdid it, and uh, I had this condition called paresthesia is what it's called when I looked it up. I don't know what the source of it is. Me and uh, both of my brothers get it, but yeah, I'm still... We got some more parts came in. Uh, it's like we're going to maybe do a little bit of work, but uh, with my hand being numb, you know, I'm just not feeling it, so it's going to be you know, more of the same of... Uh, not much going on before, until I heal up and I'm able to actually get some stuff done. So look forward to that. And uh, thank you so much.